What is going on guys and welcome back to the Hobbyist Miner channel. So it's been about 48 hours since our last video there. Um, that video, definitely one of my longer videos, just so many little snippets and clips. Wanted to kind of give you guys a heads up as to where we stand with the build. So we've gotten our 12 GPUs up and running and they are very stable right now. Uh, they've been running for 48 hours on our current configuration. There's only one of them that I needed to bump up the uh, power um, because it kept on having issues and crashing the miner. Um, so as of right now, we're running at around 162 to 164 uh, mega hash on Ravencoin right now. So that puts us at an average of about 13.5 per card at the current moment of mega hash, uh, which is great for the 470s, uh, four gig cards. Uh, we had some trouble on power. So we have three now 900 watt power supplies handling our GPUs and also our risers. And then we have a 650 watt um, EVGA that's just handling the motherboard and peripherals and stuff like that. Um, so we only have over here uh, in my unfinished basement, you guys really haven't seen the whole thing. Um, it's it's kind of cluttered with some kid stuff, little area for mining, uh, but I only have two total circuits down here. I have a 15 amp and I have a 20 amp to run everything. So to give you an idea, you know, you have the HVAC, you have a fridge, you have a hot water heater, and then gas hot water heater, keep in mind. We have a sub pump, we have a radon kit, we have now this mining rig, um, and then on top of that, we have a gaming computer, uh, we have a Unraid server, we have this kind of streaming setup, uh, and that is actually an adjustable desk too, so it pulls a lot of power, as well as these lights and stuff like that. So between all of that, we're running a 15 and a 20 amp uh, circuit on 110. And I actually had to end up putting one of the, or actually I put the EVGA 650 watt, as well as the 900 watt, on one, uh, I think it was like on the 20 amp or 15 amp, and then the other one on the 20 amp um, down here to separate them. Uh, I did some math. We actually used our voltage meter here, um, and we went ahead and plugged this into the entire rig, and it registered eight or 1,850 watts total. So that being said, uh, taking a look, we definitely are going to have to get an electrician in here. So I have an electrician scheduled now for Wednesday to come in and talk about what can I do short term. Um, I actually chatted with a few members of the community. Uh, some of them had recommended going ahead um, and actually running like a, how, seeing if the electrician can run like some high, uh, real thick SO cable, I guess they call it. It's like a, it's um, electrical um, with um, like a rubber material on the outside of it from my garage down to my basement and just do like, um, you know, a dedicated 20 amp and then just put it right here. Uh, and, and then this, it'll be dedicated just for this by itself. Um, so there's a few things I have to look at, but I'm going to talk to a professional. I, I am not, that is not where my skill set and knowledge lies to get more information on this rig. Um, I'm doing that short term because I am going to have some videos coming out here shortly, guys, talking about uh, renovations to this basement. Um, so I will be actually building a studio down here. Uh, I do stream on Twitch. There's a link down below if you want to check it out. Uh, and uh, off of the studio is going to be a door into a, a four and a half foot by 10 foot room that's going to be dedicated to crypto mining. Uh, it will have a dedicated AC as well as exhaust ducts. Uh, I actually just ordered all of the aluminum um, studs and also the tracks so that we can have that. So I'm going to do some future videos on those renovations and kind of how things are going and how things are looking. Uh, but we are limited. That's why I couldn't go past 12 cards as we got this up and running. I, I got farther and farther into this and I started to think about it. So I know we want to get to 19 GPUs. You can actually see I got the Molex in here ready to go to support additional cards. But right now I am literally power capped um, in my current situation until I get an electrician in here to do some work, which is a real bummer. But you know what? We're taking it in stages. We have a 12 GPU mining rig up and running and stable, uh, which is, is a great victory. Uh, if you guys are interested, huge shout out here to the guys at Misfit Mining. These are amazing. Like, uh, not only do they look aesthetic, aesthetically pleasing, but they've been so useful. 
um, to have these available. So I actually ordered more. Uh, I reached out to Trump Change over there. I ordered more. So once those come in and we get our power situation, we're gonna hang more cards from right here uh, to fill the rest of this. And then on the bottom rack here, I actually have a video that I'm gonna put together this week. I wanna build my first little test bench. Um, so I have some HP, old HP desktops, and I wanna pull one apart and turn it into just a Windows 10 test bench um, and see how we do with that. So I'm actually gonna build it on the bottom rack here. So we're gonna do more GPUs here in the future. And then on the bottom rack here, we're gonna go ahead and do a test bench, uh, which I'm looking forward to. Uh, to give you guys an update on a few other items, uh, I have, these cards are actually broken. Uh, I have one actually sent out for a repair to a guy in Canada. So if that goes well, we'll be getting the rest of these repaired and we'll have, even, we'll have the rest of our cards that we need to finish this 19 GPU setup. I'll get you guys his information once he's ready to make it public and I wanna make sure it goes well. You know, I, I don't want to highlight a repair GPU individual on the channel and then uh, have a bad experience for the community there. So other than that, guys, I think that's it for today. I think we kind of went over everything that we were looking to do. I'm just kind of spinning around the room, see if I missed anything. Uh, but um, I will keep you guys updated. This will be a project that we're gonna continue to update you guys as the community on. I am gonna do a 30 day uh, analysis of this. So the last analysis we did of like our first 32 days of mining, uh, there were a few things that were overlooked and you guys as the community let me know about them. So thank you very much. I do appreciate it. You were very uh, polite about it and positive about it and you didn't, you weren't negative and destroying me in comments. So we're going to go ahead and do a proper, we'll say now, um, 30 day analysis of this rig after it's been up for 30 days. We'll take some screenshots of what our wallet looks like ahead of time and we're actually gonna leave a gap between days. So I'm gonna leave about a day or two between days to make sure that like nothing trickled in or anything like that. Uh, and then we're gonna go ahead and do this to give you guys an idea of what does a 12 GPU mining rig running 12 470s, or should 13 470s and a 570 at 13.5 average mega hash, what does it exactly produce um, in a month for Raven coins. So I'm gonna put that together in the near future. I think that would be a fun video to do. Other than that, guys, I think that's it for today. If you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and share the channel with a friend. I would greatly appreciate it. Take care.